Hello ladies and gentlemen, Ghost Does Know here and here we're back for some more Valkyrie Chronicles. For this mission we're just going to use our tanks, so we're just going to take Alicia, Largo and Rosie for the CP. And off we go! We kill a few people along the way as well, just for the extra experience. Using the, your turret is more reliable than your uh, cannon shots. Anyway, sometimes you can miss them completely, but you'd be driving past them anyway. And we're going to move up a wee bit more. Alright, now we're going to end our turn and save the two extra CP. Right, on our next turn we're going to want to destroy the tank that's going over the bridge. So we'll kill that ASAP. Then make our way to the next bridge, destroy that tank. Probably have to kill the two Lancers as well. <laughs> then we can finish. If you have to, try and bait the lights. Right, sadly the tank is not in our... Right, let's let this light go to me. Because when the lights go to you, they stop. So with that, then you can just push forward, because that means the mortar strike is going to hit there. Sadly, the tank is not within our range. So, let's just... Actually, we can't kill you here, can we? Nope. Nah, screw it, then we'll just end our turn. Hmm, where is that tank? There we go. Now we can see you. Quite weird that you disappeared from the map earth momentarily. Alright, we're gonna pop another shot at you. Now we want that mortar strike to point at me at this spot because we want to cross this bridge alright so let's wait for the light to hit me let the other light hit me as well right boom right now we can move forward because the mortar strikes are there we can just get outside it right so deal with you And we just have enough to get out of the mortar range. Okay, we're kind of in the middle of it, but we should be still good. Sure. 
some damage from the lantern, not that worried about that. <laughs> now if only uh, falling off the bridge would actually kill him, that would have been awesome. I didn't see the point in the uh, shock trooper doing that, though. Now here comes the mortar strikes. Right, well, let's get rid of this pain in the butt. So we're going to deal with this Lancer. There's also another Lancer in the grass, if I remember correctly. Which we will have to get rid of you. We'll find out if that was the Lancer. Oh, there we go. There's the Lancer there. Sadly, I need to move up a wee bit. Not gonna move up too far where we're not gonna be able to kill you within range. But we don't want to get a shot in the back. No, we are going to want to get rid of that tank. Deal with the tank now. Boom. That means the next turn we can just drive right up to that. The two lanterns are going to pop shots at us, but well, we're not going to worry about that. Because they don't actually come behind your tank to the try and hit you. So if they've done that, then you wouldn't really be able to follow on with this tactic. But things do get rough. I believe you can use healing requests on your tank. Like let's say if your treads get fully damaged, then you wouldn't be able to move. Now there's someone trying to be sneaky, run up to my base. They are unaware that I have people there. Now we're gonna take another shot. Alright, so we, we're kind of a wee bit closer. And by a wee bit closer, I mean pretty damn close. Oh, we didn't even get that Lancer. I've never actually taken this much damage before when I was falling on with this tactic. So things didn't exactly go that well, but I, well, not really going to care now because you've actually hit your objective. That's another operation complete, as well as another A rank for you. I'll see you guys on the next operation.